Our next guest company offers a communication tool that brings families, teachers, and school leaders together. He is the CEO and co-founder of a company called Classroom with a K, Classroom. Frank David Cohen. Frank David, welcome into tomorrow. How are you, sir? I'm fine. Thank you. It's a How are you? I'm doing well, thanks. It's a, uh, with what little voice I still have left, weird scenario, post-COVID nonsense, um, but glad to have you with us. You're joining us, I understand, from Paris, France, yes? Exactly. Oh, I'm in Paris. We actually, we are. Uh, it's lockdown in Paris, so we're. Everybody is in their apartment. Whoa. Okay. Because uh, I see your kitchen in the background. So very lovely kitchen. Uh, so <laughs> d- glad to have you with us. And of course, everyone can come and see the kitchen. But also Frank David talking to us about Classly and Classroom when you visit into tomorrow.com. Since we have video of all of our guests these days, uh, whether it's from Paris or around the corner here in Miami. Uh, we're fortunately not on lockdown, but it's so much easier to communicate this way, especially when you're uh, a few thousand miles away. So glad to have you. Tell me, first of all, about Classroom, again, with a K. Uh, tell me about the company. So we, we, uh, st- we started this company with my childhood friend, Damien, four years ago. Actually, we are two fathers, divorced fathers. And Damien lives in New York, um, and uh, he has very, very limited rights um, uh, with her, his four-year-old daughter. Oh. So when at the time we we um, we thought about we we had this this uh, app that we wanted to launch, uh, which is really uh, uh, on privacy and and. And when he uh, told me that he was uh, really uh, uh, frustrated and sad because he didn't have any contact with the school of his daughter, we, we wanted to change that. We wanted to, to offer something to bring the family with the teachers um, and, and, you know, make this communication easy. Um, and this is why we launched actually Classly, which is our main app uh, at Classroom. Terrific. And that's Classly with a K also, uh, how do you come up with Classly? Where'd that come from? Actually, Classly is, th- is the, the fusion of three words. It's kids plus class plus family, which oh. is exactly our mission. Because our philosophy, what we believe actually, is that uh, bringing the parents into the classroom, uh, make this communication easy with the parents and the teacher, make them like team together, is really important for, chil- for children's success at school. So this is our mission and all our product is really uh, uh, working in this, um, this philosophy. And I'm glad that you shared that you and your co-founder are both divorced dads. Uh, I can relate. Uh, a lot of our staff can relate. And, and one of the problems that I think everyone can relate to uh, as a single parent or a divorced dad or divorced mom, perhaps without full time custody, is that you want to be more involved with your kids, and especially as it relates to school. And if this Classly app can help do that, that sounds like a a wonderful idea for everyone involved. Uh, Maybe not so much the ex-wife, maybe they don't care, Uh, but certainly you as a dad, your child, your children uh, will have to care that you take much more of an active part in their school life as well. Yeah, and, and you know, actually, it's not only about divorced parents because we all have, you know, jobs and, and, and uh, we, we don't have time to, to really uh, catch up with the, the, the school leaders or the teachers. So making this communication easy, you know, Classly looks like a, a social network. So actually, it's really uh, easy to use. Every parent knows how to use Facebook or Instagram. So you have the same look and feel. And, and this is really amazing how parents are involved when uh, uh, teachers are using Classly. Actually, it's a real game changer in the class. And, and for example, another thing what, that the app is doing and which is really interesting is that we can translate in a hundred languages wow. the messages from the teacher. Wow. So, because it happens, you have some parents uh, that doesn't speak the local language. Mm-hmm. So it's really important to, to keep them included in the school life to, to make this uh, uh, translation possible. And, and I apologize if I made it seem like it's only for divorced dads. I mean, I was using your example as to why you came up with Classly and thinking 
a lot of us can relate, and that makes it even more important. But it's for all parents, all teachers, all school leaders. Um, now, is this something that one has to have within the school in order to be able to use it as a parent? Actually, it started with the teacher. So you just need to be a teacher. You want to uh, uh, make the communication simple with the parents. You just need to uh, go on the App Store or on the Google Play Store. You, you download the app and like in one minute setup, you have your class and you can share the class ID with the parents so they can uh, join in. And then it's like a feed. You can share uh, posts, videos, uh, uh, photos, uh, uh, polls. If you want to ask parents some uh, stuff, um, you can you can do a lot of things, and parents can also interact with you, but in a frame way. I mean, we don't want the parents also to be like too much intrusive, you know. Yeah. Uh, so it's really important. It's, it's it looks like a social network, but it, actually it's not a social network. It's You're really right. dedicated and designed for schools. And more importantly, it's not an anti-social network, uh, which is what I've been referring to Twitter and Facebook and Instagram and that sort of thing. A lot more anti-social. Um, so is there a, a cost for the app? No, the app is free, uh, but you have some, you know, premium features you can you can subscribe if you want. But it's it's, for example, if you want, you can you can check the pictures all over the, the school year. But if you want to keep it a souvenir, you want to download the pictures in, in high definition, for example, you need to be a subscriber. Um, so it's a really little cost. It's it's uh, three uh, forty nine per month. Uh, per, three three dollars and forty nine cents. Right. Yeah. OK. Not 300, <laughs> so we don't want no, to scare anyone. No, no. So less than $4 a month, you, you can subscribe and have these additional features. Yeah, but it's, I mean, if you don't want those features, you can use the app and, yeah. and be really happy with it. So okay. most of our parents actually are, are using the free version, but you have the, those, those uh, premium feature available if you want. And you, at the end of the year, you can also order a yearbook uh, because a lot of teachers, actually 97% of our uh, teachers, uh, users, uh, are sharing all over the year pictures uh, inside the class. So you can, for example, at the end of your year, the year, you can buy this uh, this uh, yearbook that we call Class Book, cool. which is really, really a great souvenir. No doubt. Also with a K, Class Book, right? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Very good. So really, it sounds like we need to convince teachers, uh, and it probably doesn't take a lot of convincing once they see the app and how handy it can be, uh, but you've got to convince the teacher to get the app and then the students, uh, whomever chooses or the parents that choose in that class to participate uh, would then be able to use the app as well. I'm guessing it's not a, a big uh, deal to try to get teachers involved. Actually, it, what, it, what, it, what works, to be honest, is when you have a teacher using the app, you can be sure the teacher will be happy, the parents will be happy. So you have this viral, you know, um, um, ear, uh, mouse to uh, ear, right? Yeah. In English. Sure. Word <laughs> so of mouth. Just, uh, yeah. yeah. So so then uh, it, it works like that because people are happy. It's like a good restaurant. It, when the food is good, you you're 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 just spreading the word, and it, yeah. it works the same with the app. So can the teachers do things like share the child's report card with the parents? Uh, so, or, or information like that, uh, you know, that, uh, or just general info in the classroom with specific parents or all parents if it's homework assignments or things of that nature? Actually, you can do all of that. You can, you can share a ho homework assignments. You can have like a private message with parents, some parents, if you want to share like really personal stuff. Or you can have like announcement for the whole class. And even we have another tool called Classboard for the school principal, so you can share as well, uh, like you can broadcast a message from the school to the whole parent community. So it's oh, really, terrific. really convenient. Terrific. And I understand that your Classly app, again, Classly with a K, uh, also has helped children recover from the COVID learning slide, which is kind of a nice way of putting it, where so many uh, students were just unable to attend class, unfortunately, many still to this day. Uh, we don't typically have that problem here in Florida. Uh, most of the kids have been back to school for some time. But still, there was a period of time when all of the students were unable to attend, and that became a major issue. Uh, so getting them back on track, I'm guessing, Classly can play a role there, too. Yeah, actually, as, as I said earlier, um, I think the, the parent has a really huge role to play. And I think it's really important, especially in the context with this COVID learning slide that we can 
now uh, start to to really uh, realize. And I, I think, unfortunately, it's going to be like a major issue in the next month because we have all over the world. It's not only in the United States or in France. All over the world, you have a lot of countries they closed the school, so you have the children. They were like out of school for three months, two months. So it's it's huge. And in some family, some of their children are really uh, lucky because their parents were behind here, uh, uh, making them work at, at home. Yeah. But in other uh, families, it's not the case. So you have this, you know, uh, all, all of the, the children are, are not anymore on the same um, level. Yeah. So we, we, we need to and to help the teachers uh, um, like recovering from for, for this uh, uh, from this uh, learning uh, slide. Sure. Now, uh, can Classly be used for at home learning as well? Because, again, unfortunately, not every student is, is able to get back to class. Some have been out for a year now. Um, does Classly work in that sense as, as kind of a an ability to help the teachers move assignments or even teach? Sure. Actually, last year when the pandemic started, we uh, immediately in integrated um, uh, the video conference. So you have like a Zoom like uh, feature inside the, the app. Good. So you, as a parent, you don't need to install or uh, subscribe to any other uh, app. You just need to have your Classly app and then you can uh, you can have this remote learning uh, feature. Terrific. And um, we have also this uh, feature that we call Classwork, which is like home assignment, but much that you can uh, share assignments and the student can uh, give back the, the assignment to the teacher and uh, comment and have some uh, chat with the teacher if they need. So it's really um, uh, adapted for this kind of situation. And if, if it happens again, we are ready. Gotcha. And let's hope it doesn't. But by the same token, all the other advantages to using the Classly app will continue to play an important role. And it is available for both Android and iOS, correct? Yes, exactly. And we also have a web app, so you can even use it from um, uh, a desktop computer uh, with your uh, like Safari or Chrome or Mozilla, whatever uh, browser you're using. Excellent. Well, we certainly invite our audience to check it out. And uh, it is free in the App Store. Look for Classly with a K, K-L-A-S-S-L-Y. And of course, they can visit your website at Classroom with a K, classroom.co, not .com, right? Classroom.co. Yeah, exactly. And of course, we'll link them there when they visit us at intotomorrow.com and see your interview on video as well. Uh, Frank David, we appreciate what you're doing to help the kids. I like on your website how you say, we believe children grow better when families and teachers work together. And absolutely, that's very, very true. Uh, it, it used to be in the old days, it was the Parent Teacher Association, and maybe you'd get together once or twice in the school year. It's become much more important to be able to stay in contact with your kids' teachers uh, on a more regular basis, and it seems like Classly is doing just that. So kudos to you guys. Keep up the good work, and thanks for joining us. Thank you very much. My pleasure. Classroom, K-L-A-S-S-R-O-O-M dot C-O. We'll get you there. Visit us at intotomorrow.com. We're back with more as we bring you further Into Tomorrow. I'm Dave Graveline. Stay tuned right here on the Advanced Media Network.